pretty fast. It's complete. Yep, see it leveled up. And then you can go ahead and put points into here, like most. I'm gonna put a lot into damage and crit. Not much so much of speed, because these guys are already really, really uh, fast. They're quick. So I don't want to put too much into that, to start at least. Go ahead and do that. Here, oh yeah, recently a lot of people have been doing the newest class, which is Scythe class, which is what I started with. It's really awesome. Because you have like three pets that you summon, and then you have your idol on. So you have like four pets, and then plus you. So you basically have five people attacking one mob at a time. So if you want to do PvP, that's your deal. Oh, another cool thing is you have the um, auto uh, potions. So once you get to kind of a low health, it automatically uh, goes and does your potions for you. That's a cool move. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at these. Get an additional earth charge. I don't really know what the charges are. I have to figure that much out, but it shouldn't be too hard. Oh, thanks for helping me out. Another thing that's cool is you can all attack the one mob together, and it doesn't take away anything from you as long as you like hit it at least once, and the other guy kills it, you still get the credit. Maybe not as much XP, but you still get credit. Okay, I'm just gonna kill one of these guys because I'm about to level. I don't know. get one attack point and oh another cool thing the envoy's path it's pretty neat I'll show you it right now if I open this up you get points for this when you level up and yeah so basically you can decide what you want to do here I can increase HP evasion damage or speed as I said I'm gonna go with some more damage for right now you can see how tanky I can be and as soon as, wait, no, I want to go into some crit here. Yeah. As soon as I open up this, I'm going to put it into HP and defense, not much of evasion, because I already have that basically built into this class. Uh, okay. Um, freshly cut lumber. Here we go. Not all the quests, like a lot of, uh, you know, MMORPGs are just kill, 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 kill. There's some like these where you, um, go ahead and collect stuff. You know, it's it's just not quite as generic. And always, as always, in the starter area, there's uh, an excessive amount of people. Alright, so now I gotta go hit these guys in the head with a hammer. Yeah. Watch. Yeah, best way to be waking up. Let's just hit somebody in the head with a hammer. Here's another one. So, I don't know how long I'm going to play this. At a point, it gets to an area where you kind of you kind of just do um, kind of the same thing. Like, there's storyline, 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 and then it just kind of gets to a point where you have to do a bunch of boring, boring, and boring until you hit to the storyline again. Don't really know what I'm going to do once we get to that point. I might just end it, go to a different MMO. Ah, here we go. He poisoned me. <laughs> I'm so dizzy. Uh, okay, see? Is that my little thing? No, not quite. Okay, so I gotta talk to this person. Normally, I do read through some of these, but I can't talk, so. Alright guys, so we got a new skill. This is a healing skill. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw it over here. Put teleportation up there. So every class gets their certain healing skills, so it's pretty it's pretty well balanced. Everybody, most classes at least, get some kind of healing, so that they don't they're not quite as squishy. So uh, I think the scythe class actually does not have a heal. So if you saw in the character creation where there are all the stars for what they have, if you have a zero for healing, you don't you don't have anything. But I do have a star in support for. Scythe, so that gives me, um, that it lets me, uh, have, like, buffs, so, 
the reason why I chose this class is because it has everything. It has single target, it has AoE, it has um, everything. Just everything to make a good solo class. Let's see, one more. That's a fun skill where I just kind of teleport all the way over to him. Alright, jump back over here. I think I'll be getting my little floaty thing soon. Just a floating blue ball. Complete. Escape. Accept. Now I gotta go find some shrooms for me, for him to drug me. Basically, I just kinda get drugged over and over again when it seems like everyone just kinda hates me. Yeah. At the beginning of this, you just like constantly, like, they, they give you drugs and you get dizzy and then. Yeah, it's, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have stuck around, <laughs> honestly. Let's go ahead and grab this again. Alright. Is he gonna drug me this time? Okay then. You have fun there on the ground. Complete. Yay, level up. Level 5. Complete. Not gonna quite use that yet because I have some points to throw in here. Put that into damage. Okay, and then put that into crit. There we go. And then there. Nom 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 nom. And then drug. <laughs> Dizziness. I feel extremely uncomfortable. Sort of incredible power now, though. So, waiting for my idol on person to come along. Complete. Learn new skill. Glide. See? So, basically, it's R to glide. And then it also gives me the skill 10 ton drop. Which is actually completely useless. So, let's just move it up there. Go ahead and show you guys. Whee! <laughs> it's awesome because you go really, really, really fast. So, and if I go ahead and click over here, I can go over to this lady and follow the path of glitter a lot faster. So, it just makes things easier. So, you know, they just hit spacebar to fall down slowly. If you could stop, I do not want to do this anymore. Oh god! It's still trying to tell me how to how to do it. I've already done it, bro. All right, whatever. That's gonna be annoying. So let's just go ahead and do this. Skip complete. There we go. Accept. Go ahead and kill these guys. That's that's really annoying. I don't know why it won't go away. It normally does. It's just probably being stupid and glitching. <sighs> Nothing too bad though, so. Alright. I got my heals going on. This actually gives me evasion plus twenty-three and crit twenty-three. That's actually not bad. Ah, oh, I see. So some skills take these things right here. And that does. It takes all of them. Depending on how many you have, is tells you how much stuff you get. So I gotta kill one of these. Alright. There we go. That one's done. Now I just have to kill these guns. And you get an aggro multiple at a time if you have a lot of AoE attacks. So, you know. Just your sort of, sort of ish, typ typical MMO. Nothing too special, just fun. Oh, finally, that thing went away. Alright, kill them all. Let's talk to a lady named Flower again. Alright, I got my little floating blue orb behind me. There we go. I got another Envoy's Path. Pretty soon I'm gonna get my first melt. So. Um, let's, let's just go ahead and look at these. Alright, that's something that I want, so I have to train right there. I think. And then that one will be unlocked after I train there and there. Okay, so. Alright. Let's go ahead and collect these raised mounds get these relic fragments 
Oh, yeah. I'm gonna play GW2 as well. You guys are gonna be seeing a bunch of MMOs from me. So, if you don't like that, don't watch. But I hope at least some of you guys like it. Maybe, uh, yeah, so. Whatever. Maybe have some Guild Wars 2. I'll also have some Minecraft coming out. But it's gonna be a lot of these kinds of things. Let's go take him down. This was like a really fast kill with my scythe. It's just, it's kind of an OP class to be honest. Let's go ahead and activate my heal and keep on, keep on hitting. You might see some maple sword, maybe rift. I don't know. It just depends on what I feel. Rift isn't actually. I looked at it. I downloaded it. I was like, eh, eh. It's like, it's, it's all right, but it's not exactly what I thought it would be. So. Let's go. Now you have to wait for these people to come over here. Think, well, no, that's not this quest. 